from the world's tallest building, taller than the Tower of Jeddah in the center of China, to an identical replica of the Titanic, but bigger and better. Here are six of the world's crazy mega projects that were never built. Number 1. Freedom Ship The Freedom Ship, also known as the Floating City, was a brilliant maritime housing concept created by Norman Nixon, an American engineering pioneer. The concept on which the ship was designed was similar to floating cities serving as extra living spaces in the future. If it was finished, it would have been the world's largest vessel. For this ship to have been legally accepted, international maritime norms and the laws of the country in which it would have sailed had to accept it. Hence, the crew members as well as manufacturers ensured it fit just that. It was more sophisticated than any ordinary ship or floating residential complex it would be more like a parade of barges. This cruise ship design aimed to provide permanent residential, recreational, and business channels aboard a ship to help consumers become tax-free. It should have included a luxurious contemporary city complex and a large residential area. An airport would have been built on the ship's top deck for the convenience of the passengers. Consider the Titanic, but without the catastrophe and everything, the lovely element of it. The Freedom Ship would have been larger, better, and more badass. But it wasn't considered, since various sources estimate the cost of the building to be approximately $10 billion. Furthermore, it has never piqued the interest of enough potential investors to meet the predicted sum. Sad that money was the reason this marvel couldn't come to life. The Freedom Ship was not meant to be a cruise ship. Rather, it was meant to be a one-of-a-kind place to live, work, retire, vacation, or visit. The planned voyage would have endlessly traveled around the world, visiting most of the world's coastlines. It would have ferried inhabitants and visitors to and from the seaside using its vast fleet of commuter aircraft and hydrofoils. Private and small commercial aircraft would have been able to land at the top deck airport. Number 2. China's Sky City China's Sky City skyscraper was an 838 meters tall structure in Changsha, Hunan, South Central China, which was anticipated to be constructed in only 90 days, but the total time required was 210 days. Pre-construction operations were paused due to further clearances required by government officials. Sky City would have been the world's highest structure if erected, but unfortunately, that didn't happen. Imagine something taller than the Tower of Jeddah. That must be one hell of a structure. We're pretty sure living there would have cost a fortune. It was never built because it never got the necessary government approval. Maybe the Chinese government isn't just as skyscraper friendly as the United Arab Emirates. Number 3. Dome over Manhattan as warnings concerning the severity and ramifications of climate change have grown more serious in recent years, proposals to prevent global warming have become increasingly extreme. Yes, global warming appears to be coming for us all. Well, to combat the great enemy known as global warming, a brilliant suggestion was made by Buckminster Fuller, Bucky to pals, suggesting in the 1950s that a glass dome be built over a substantial area of New York City. As the project was dubbed, the Dome over Manhattan would stretch from river to river and from 21st to 64th streets, creating a regulated environment for those fortunate enough to be trapped in this bubble. Besides providing shelter from the weather, Fuller's calculations showed that the dome would have improved energy efficiency and dramatically reduced heat loss in the structures within. It would have created the perfect atmosphere. The strategy was ridiculous, but it was also carefully thought out. Fuller and his associate architect, Shoji Sadao, had good reasons for each design and technical decision, no matter how alien the designs appeared. But that wasn't enough to persuade the government to contemplate it seriously, hence why it was never built, because the government didn't agree with his vision. The dome over Manhattan was never completed, which would not have shocked Fuller, who boasted of being the world's greatest successful failure. Number 4. The Millennium Tower, Tokyo The Millennium Tower was a 180-story skyscraper by Sir Norman Foster in 1989. He planned to build it in Tokyo Bay, two kilometers off the coast of Tokyo, Japan. The concept asked for an 840-meter, high cone-shaped pyramid with a base the size of the Tokyo Olympic Stadium and glass sides for natural illumination. It was planned to be built on the water, with boat and bridge access. 
Because the tower was designed for a region prone to earthquakes and hurricane-forced winds, the form was aerodynamic to decrease wind stress and spiral bands wrap around the tower for structural support. Meanwhile, steel tanks at the top of the tower were filled with water and may be rotated to act as a wind counterbalance. There's no way this was not a mega project. And not just mega, a mind-blowing one. Imagine a tower that could bend to suit the extremities of nature. The tower was a self-contained arcology, a fusion of architecture and ecology with 1 million square meters of commercial development and 60,000 people's residences. It was not just a technological marvel, but also an architectural one. This amazing structure couldn't even be built. Because of a bad economic recession Japan experienced some years back, this inflated the price of building materials and also housing costs as well. So in reality, if it was actually built, no one would have been able to afford it and its owners would have run into a huge debt. Number 5. Shimizu Mega City Pyramid the Shimizu Megacity Pyramid would have been a gigantic self-sustaining arcology pyramid that would contain enterprises, parks, and other amenities above Tokyo Bay. I'd have called this heaven because it would have practically contained everything humans desire and less restrictive rules. The construction would have been 2,004 meters tall with five stacked trusses the size of the Great Pyramid of Giza and would have been able to accommodate over a million people. Although this pyramid would have only served a small portion of the greater Tokyo area's population, it would have contributed to Tokyo's growing space needs. To be honest, everyone wanted to build because of how amazing it might have been. The projected design, however, cannot be completed due to the weight. The design was predicated on the eventual availability of super strong lightweight materials based on carbon nanotubes and graphene, which were very difficult to come by. Hopefully in the future, scientists must have developed these materials. The projected period for the building's completion was roughly 20 to 50 years. Still, given that some of the materials, which could have been used in its construction, may not be readily available by then, we may be looking at a century. Yes, I agree, it was a very long period, hence why it can never be built. If completed, it will be the biggest artificial building in history. What a fantastic design! Sadly, that might never happen. Number 6. Dover Calais Euroroute Bridge The Euroroute Bridge, which was designed by Jean-Paul Viguier to link Calais and Dover, could have been too futuristic. One would think the Millennium Tower was the best thing anyone could think of, but this bridge exceeds it by far. When creating the bridge, the guy probably watched too many movies and lost focus on reality. The Guir's Bridge would have stretched just part of the way over the Strait of Dover before going deep into the water, serving as a metaphor for Anglo-French ties. If there's one thing you didn't know, the bridge from Calais would have led to a mid-sea island from where it would spiral down throughout major areas in the city into an underground tube, creating access to all and everyone around it. However, because due to the high expenses, intricate infrastructure, and intense marine traffic, this idea was never realized. Brilliance in its true form, which never came to life. But if you think that's amazing, check out a dome over a whole city. Trust me guys, it's phenomenal, but sadly, never built as well. We're taking your love for mega projects to the next level, so subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for the wonderful content we have in store.